The 1980s marked a dynamic and transformative period in the world of sports. Characterized by the emergence of iconic athletes who not only dominated their respective disciplines but also leveraged their prowess to amass substantial wealth. From the hardwood of basketball courts to the greens of golf courses and from the boxing ring to the tennis court, these athletes became not only sports legends but also cultural phenomena. Step into the vibrant world of the 1980s where athleticism, charisma, and global recognition converged. Explore the captivating journeys of the era's top 10 highest paid athletes whose prowess on and off the field defined an era of sports and pop culture. Number 10. Michael Jordan Michael Jordan, widely regarded as one of the greatest basketball players of all time, transcended the sports world and became an iconic figure both on and off the court. His impact on the world of sports, popular culture, and business during the 1980s is immeasurable. Born on February 17, 1963 in Brooklyn, New York, Jordan's journey to stardom began at the University of North Carolina, where he won a national championship in 1982. He then entered the NBA as the third overall pick in the 1984 draft, joining the Chicago Bulls. From the moment he stepped onto the court, it was evident that Jordan possessed a unique blend of athleticism, skills, and competitive fire. His soaring dunks, clutch shots, and unmatched work ethic made him a six-time NBA champion with the Chicago Bulls during the decade. Number 9. Magic Johnson Magic Johnson, born Irvin Johnson Jr. on August 14, 1959 in Lansing, Michigan, is a basketball legend who defined the point guard position and left an indelible mark on the sport during the 1980s. Johnson's journey to stardom began at Michigan State University, where he led his team to an NCAA championship in 1979. His extraordinary passing ability, court vision, and versatility caught the attention of NBA scouts, and he was selected first overall by the Los Angeles Lakers in the 1979 NBA Draft. Throughout the 1980s, Magic Johnson's on-court brilliance helped propel the Lakers to numerous championships. His unique style of play, characterized by his showtime fast breaks and no-look passes, transformed the way basketball was played. Number 8. Arnold Palmer Arnold Palmer, often referred to as the King, was a legendary golfer whose impact extended beyond the fairways and greens of the golf course. Born on September 10, 1929 in Latrobe, Pennsylvania, Palmer became one of the most recognizable and beloved figures in the world of sports during the 1980s. Palmer's golf career reached its zenith in the late 1950s and 1960s when he amassed a remarkable number of victories, including multiple major championships. He was known for his aggressive playing style, swashbuckling approach, and his magnetic connection with fans. Palmer's charisma and genuine down-to-earth demeanor endeared him to golf enthusiasts and casual observers alike. By the 1980s, while his competitive playing career had slowed down, Palmer's influence remained strong. Before we move on, support us by hitting subscribe and the bell icon to get notified when we post new videos. Now, let's get back to our topic. Number 7. Mike Tyson Mike Tyson, often referred to as Iron Mike, was a polarizing and electrifying figure in the world of boxing during the 1980s and beyond. Born on June 30, 1966 in Brooklyn, New York, Tyson's boxing career began with a rapid ascent that captured the attention of sports fans around the world. Tyson's rise to prominence was marked by his indelible power, aggressive style, and remarkable success in the ring. Trained by Cus D'Amato and later Kevin Rooney, Tyson became the youngest heavyweight champion in history at the age of 20 when he defeated Trevor Burbick in 1986. His aggressive fighting style and knockout victories earned him a reputation as one of the most feared boxers in history. Number 6. Larry Bird Larry Bird, often referred to as Larry Legend, is a basketball icon whose impact on the sport during the 1980s is still felt today. Born on December 7, 1956, in West Baden Springs, Indiana, Bird's journey to becoming one of the greatest basketball players of all time is a testament to his skill, work ethic, and basketball IQ. Bird's basketball career took off at Indiana State University, where he led the team to the NCAA championship game in 1979. He then entered the NBA as a first-round draft pick by the Boston Celtics in 1978. Throughout the 1980s, Bird became a central figure in the fierce Celtics-Lakers rivalry that defined the era. Bird's versatility, shooting prowess, and court vision made him a standout player. Number 5. Jack Nicholas. Jack Nicholas, often referred to as the Golden Bear, is a golfing legend whose influence and success spanned several decades, including the 80s. 
Born on January 21, 1940 in Columbus, Ohio, Nicholas is widely regarded as one of the greatest golfers of all time. Nicholas's golfing career reached its zenith in the 1960s and 70s, during which he secured numerous major championships and earned a reputation for his precision and strategic approach to the game. However, even in the 1980s, Nicholas remained a force to be reckoned with on the golf course. He secured victories in major championships, including the U.S. Open and the Masters Tournament. Nicholas's ability to maintain his competitiveness in the face of younger generations of golfers showcased his enduring skill and dedication to the sport. Number 4. Joe Montana Joe Montana, often simply referred to as Joe Cool, is a legendary American football quarterback who left an indelible mark on the sport during the 1980s. Born on July 11, 1956 in New Eagle, Pennsylvania, Montana's career as a quarterback is synonymous with success, leadership, and clutch performances. Montana's journey to stardom began at the University of Notre Dame, where he showcased his football prowess. He then entered the NFL as a third-round draft pick by the San Francisco 49ers in 1979. During the 1980s, Joe Montana orchestrated his team to four Super Bowl victories, earning three Super Bowl MVP awards in the process. Number 3. Sugar Ray Leonard Sugar Ray Leonard, born Ray Charles Leonard on May 17, 1956 in Wilmington, North Carolina, is a boxing legend known for his exceptional skill, charisma, and contributions to the sport during the 1980s. Leonard's boxing career reached its pinnacle in the 1970s and 1980s. He first gained widespread attention by winning a gold medal in the light welterweight division at the 1976 Summer Olympics. His professional boxing career featured memorable battles against some of the era's most prominent fighters, cementing his legacy as one of the best pound-for-pound -pound boxers of all time. His two bouts in 1980, known as the Brawl in Montreal and the No Mas Fight, captured the imagination of boxing fans and showcased Leonard's adaptability and strategic prowess. Number 2. Martina Navratilova Martina Navratilova, born Martina Subertova on October 18, 1956, in Prague, Czechoslovakia, now the Czech Republic, is a tennis legend who dominated the sport during the 1980s. Known for her powerful game, versatility, and commitment to excellence, Navratilova left an indelible mark on the world of tennis. Navratilova's professional career began in the 1970s, but it was during the 1980s that she truly cemented her status as one of the greatest tennis players of all time. Her rivalry with Chris Evert was a centerpiece of women's tennis during the era, and their contrasting playing styles added drama and excitement to the matches. Number 1. Chris Evert Chris Everett, born Christine Marie Everett on December 21, 1954 in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, is a tennis legend whose dominance on the court during the 1980s solidified her status as one of the greatest female tennis players in history. Everett's tennis career began in the 1970s, but her success carried into the 1980s, where she continued to excel and leave an indelible mark on the sport. Her rivalry with Martina Navratilova defined women's tennis during this era and produced some of the most memorable matches in the history of the sport. Known for her exceptional baseline game, consistency, and mental fortitude, Everett was a force to be reckoned with on all surfaces. She won numerous Grand Slam titles, including multiple French Open and U.S. Open championships. So that's it. Please like, share, and comment your thoughts below if you like this video. Remember to subscribe to see our next video. Stay safe and we'll be back soon with another video.